Hello everyone, it's time for some vintage toys. What could there be inside these boxes? Tune in in just a second. Okay, first and foremost, this one here, I got a little bit banged up in the mail. Um, I already opened it up. I wanted to make sure everything was fine inside. Um, I got this little lot of Big Jim. Yes, sir. Everything here is Big Jim. Big Jim, of course, was made by Mattel Toys from 1971 to about 1979 here in the United States of America. But it continued for nearly 10 more years overseas. Uh, about 86, I think. 1987. Probably around that period of time. Okay, let's get to it. This, of course, is coming from Sacramento, California, from Stephen. Thank you very much, Stephen. Getting this all for $10.50? Awesome. <laughs> all right. Great. First thing on the top is right here. This is a bilingual, or, well, actually, no, it's not bilingual. It's, um, it's German. It's a German booklet uh, that you would get when you... When you when you uh, opened up uh, your package, you know, like in boxes and all that, and, and the big toy accessories. Check it out; that is very cool. That alone is pretty awesome. There's the back of it. Very cool. <coughs> Ooh, knock out the Jeff. <laughs> all right, and of course, Mr. Big Jim himself. There you go. He's a great looking. I mean, he's in really good shape, and of course, um, you know. His arms are great. Color on it is really nice. And of course, the um, the motion here on the back, this uh, back back bu button that you push on there to make him do his uh, thing. First, you gotta line up his arm. So, he does his karate chop motion, of course. Um, that button technology, Mattel would use that again in 1978 for Pulsar Man, the ultimate man of adventure. Pulsar, of course, I do have Pulsar Man, and Hypnos, because he only had one villain. <laughs> and I also have the um, life support system thing, you know, because they made three items for Pulsar Man, and that was it. It is what it is. Okay, moving along. Open this up here. This is a, they put a bunch of extra, I mean, this guy just loaded me up with all kinds of goodies. Got a big gym hat. That could be for anybody, any one of them. Yeah. Um, boots, <laughs> boots, shoes, like gloves, playing hockey, some shoes, there it is, all kinds of games. Let's see that way. This is an Olympic outfit, jacket, his pants, this is the uh, boxing outfit he wears. Check it out, it's pretty sweet. Yeah, awesome. The shorts, and there we go. more shoes. <laughs> and the boxing gloves, of course. Boxing gloves. Are All right, move along here. And then we got some uh, diving gear there. Here's a scuba tank, little thing. You strap it down to his back. Very cool. Right. And we got some tiny little, little thing here. It's got a couple of odds and ends in here. I don't know. I haven't built the thing that it came with. Uh, this is very important here. You know, this is it a gold medal. Check it out. <laughs> gold medal. Dun, 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 dun. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I like it. Mm -hmm. And if we got here, I'm not going to pull them all out. Got a multitude of outfits. Crazy. Very cool. And this uh, particular thing here, over here, it's, uh, you would load him up in there so you can swing him back and forth to make the appearance that he's punching. Very cool. Can't wait to put it together. More pieces of that particular item. And then we got a couple. Little odd pieces. There's a uh, fish. 
Fishy, 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 fishy. <laughs> There's this fishing pole. This here, of course, is um, the belt that stabilizes and keep them, keeps them in place so that when you're using this particular item here, that way he doesn't fly off the handle. <laughs> and of course, this is the uh, boxing thing. Very cool. Well, that is the first big gym item. And I got more coming up here in just a second.